Hey everybody, it's Joshua Parbenard here. I have my first tabula example. It's a visualization within a tooltip. It's a pretty cool little trick to use to help show extra information within your charts. You can only use it in your charts, not in your dashboards. But let's uh, get going. You take your data and we'll connect it here to uh, tabula and uh, get the information loaded in. Go to our first sheet. And the first thing we're going to do is uh, just rename this sheet to tree map. And we'll make a new sheet, rename that to highlight map or highlight table. And then we'll save the whole workbook as visualization within tooltip example. Okay, great. So now we got the workbook started. Let's go back to tree map and we're going to uh, actually go back to a highlight table. <laughs> and now we're going to create a highlight table, but without using the show me uh, menu. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to take the uh, PM 2.5 concentration and drag it onto the color mark. And then uh, we're going to change this over from sum to an average. And then uh, we'll bring over the T PM 2.5 concentration over to the labels mark. And we'll also change that over from sum to average. And from here, we will uh, drag our dates up to the column, take city, bring it to row, and season to row. As you can see now, we basically have a highlight table except the font is highlighted and not the background. So to fix this, we go over to the marks card and change it from automatic to square. And there we go. We have a nice, lovely highlight table. So now we'll want to go over to tree map and and the reason I'm using a tree map for this example is because it has groups and it's a really easy and good way to show off the visualizations within a tooltip. So uh, go to your tree map worksheet and drag over the PM 2.5 concentration to the colors mark again and um, change that to an average. And now bring over the PM 2.5 concentration to the size and change that over to an average. And then now drag city onto detail. And as you can see, we basically have a tree map now. Um, it brought over county as well. We don't want that, so just go ahead and remove it. It doesn't actually change anything, but um, or country. Um, but it doesn't really change anything, but. Uh, just get rid of it. Uh, and then we'll bring a city over to label just so we can see which one of these blocks, uh, what, what they mean. So there you got it. That's already our tree map um, made and without using the show me menu whatsoever. So now to actually have a visualization within our tooltip, uh, we we find the tooltip uh, mark as always is in the marks card. Click that once. Let's go ahead and clear the text that is already there. Then we'll go to Insert, Sheets, and Highlight Table. And that's literally <laughs> all you need to do. So click OK. And now you can see when I hover over Beijing, it shows Beijing. And Chengdu is Chengdu. Shenyang is just Shenyang. But as you can see, the tooltip, the size is limited, and our highlight table is too big. So let's go back to the highlight table and let's format everything to work. So let's hide the title. Let's get rid of the um, field labels for columns. Let's rotate the labels. Let's adjust the font to be just one 
size smaller great now let's shrink everything down now here you don't want to get too small because it actually won't work in the other view so now we go back to tree map and it almost fits perfectly so let's just that should about do it nope and as you saw some of them are number symbols as you can see some of them are still um, number symbols so that's too small so let's just bring it back still got the number of symbols so as you can see it's a little bit of a back and forth process but there we go um ah, still didn't fit perfectly did it so boom and boom and there we go so now you can change the colors to be more suited I think uh, what I did was I chose uh, green gold uh, red diverging it's a pretty good color scheme and then the tree map we used temperature diverging and for the fonts just right click format I actually just go label um, middle align everything let's get this to be a more exciting font bump it up in size and there we go visualization within a tool tip example <clears throat> And there's our wonderful chart, a tree map showing the PM average PM 2.5 concentrations for Beijing, Chengdu, Xinjiang, Shanghai, and Guangzhou. And when we hover over one of these cities, it shows us as much information as it can, which in this case would be the seasonal breakdowns from 2012 to 2015. And it even colors them to show us how high or low the concentrations are. I hope uh, you enjoyed this walkthrough. I have a step-by-step uh, -step walkthrough on my website, my blog, uh, joshuapaulbernard.net. Uh, please check it out, and have a great day. Thank you very much. Goodbye.